What's up, MVPs? Apparently, we received a brand new patch, a new update. I'm hoping this update fixes a lot of the issues, especially the ones that the Xbox players were going through. But what I'm going to go ahead and do is go through all these notes to give you guys all the information and explain what's going on with these patches. But before we get into that, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get it. Our top priority is patch is to integrating additional fixes for Xbox performance and desyncing and matches. The main thing, right. Following the update, please drop by our socials and let us know how you feel about the improvements, blah, blah, blah. All right, we're gonna go into the general. All characters now incur a 15 frame repeat move lockout on each all characters now occur a 15 frame repeat move lockout on their ground side attack combo this will prevent individual fighters from alternating ground side attacks and dodge to lock enemies and hit stun for extended periods of time all right so i was right okay they took that out camera minimum distance in 1v1 has been increased okay that's cool so more of a zoom out in the camera all available profile icon banner badges ring outs and announcer track will appear in account cosmetics section of the fighters tab all right i guess some people like me didn't have all of their shit so now you should see all your cosmetics that you did have all right general bug fixes address it address more issues <laughs> impacting performance on xbox x series and s that's cool fix two issues causing matches to desync so obviously they found some issues fix an issue where pairing an attack will not always put the victim into parry stun thank you let's go whoa we already got a freaking nerf on the perk now limited to one one use per air time fixed an issue where an attempting to spawn a platform will not consume an air evade sheesh all right fixed an issue where lebron could not spawn a platform where he did not have a basketball damn one time per use is crazy banana guard got another nerf ground side special active hitbox window reduced two frames cool Get your ass out of here. Black Adam. He got two nerfs. Jump branch window delay six frames. Ground side attack two. Jump branch window delay eight frames. So Black Adam can no longer just jab you and put you in this stupid loop. Bugs Bunny. Ground down special. Fix an issue where Bugs can cancel hit stun by jumping in certain conditions. They fix Bugs Bunny um bullshit that's cool garnets okay air ground side special cooldown not back angle made more vertical air ground side special more vertical so they, it's gonna be harder for them to um gizmo gizmo maneuverability and size make him incredibly difficult to pin down his movement combined with his, his, his incredibly strong zone game make it nearly impossible from some characters to get the edge even against them these changes should help bring gizmo eventually Evasiveness more in line with the cast, so it's easier for other characters to get up close and punish. All right, we so happy that Gizmo is taking L's. Damn! Ground side attack two, dodge branch window delayed ten, ten frames, prevents terrain bounce on not back. Air ground neutral attack on with branch window delayed eight frames. Cooldown is no longer refunded on a successful fire arrow hit. What? That was a thing with Gizmo? Ground side special. Car HP reduced to eight from 10. All right. Card explosion hitbox size reduced 25%. 25%. It's crazy. Car maximum right. overheat duration reduced to 1.25 from two seconds. All right. That's cool. Cooldown increased to 18 seconds from 15 seconds. Let's go. They got to play the game. Gizmo has to play the game. I'm happy. Air side special. Now always transitions to umbrella float if attack whiffs. Let's go. If they whiff the umbrella, they're going to the sky. This is Harley now. Another top, another top five. Harley slide and up attack were granting her very easy combos for very little risk. These changes should keep her combo game intact while making slide up attack feel less like doing everything buttons. Okay, that's cool. Ground up attack. Base knockback increase from 1800 from 1663. Wide though. On hit, branch window delays 10 frames. Okay, I guess you can't just follow it up. I get it. Okay, that's cool. Ground down attack. 
Start a window before charge increase four frames. Nice. Start a window after charge increase two frames. Cool. Slide combos into follow ups faster. This still sounds scary. No, I'm not gonna lie. It's still, she still got combo game because it says slide combos into follow up faster. So you can still follow her up, but the hit stun is reduced. Okay. So you got to read your character more with Harley. I like that. I like that. Maximum movement from charge reduced 15%. Now ignores player collision during movement. Okay, I like that. Leg hurt box size increased slightly. Iron oh, Giant player was dominated by his easy to input infinites and few early kill setups. We're hoping that removing his most egregious setups will make him feel more like the rest of the cast. And we feel good about letting players play with him again. So Iron Giant is back. He's back. He's back. He's back. Passive. Raise meter gain from ally damage reduced to 60% of damage taken from 80%. Okay. Raise meter gain from an ally ring out reduced to 30% of a total meter from 35%. Defensive burst cooldown increased to 29 seconds from 25 seconds. Defensive burst knockback made more horizontal. Okay. Because if you guys remember that burst when you hit people... Sometimes it'll hit you in a uh, an angle going up, so it's cool. Defensive burst, not back reduced. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Ground down attack, not back angle made more horizontal. All right, that's cool. So you can't follow it up that easily. Ground side special fighters are now immediately released when Iron Giant performs an emote. <laughs> Fighters are now immediately released when Iron Giant leaves the ground. Okay. Grab release knockback ang angle made more horizontal. Grab release hit stun reduced. Startup window increased. Armor applied earlier. Okay. They gave him a buff there. Rage mode. Ground down attack. Now incurs a repeat move lockout to prevent infinite trapping enemies. Okay. Rage mode. Air ground up attack. Cooldown increased to 1.5 seconds from 0.75. Neutral special fixed an issue where iron giant were performing his non-rage neutral specials while in rage mode i mean all you had to really worry about is that they take away the 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 loops jason ground dash attack oh jason got a buff they gave J jason now blocks projectiles let's go Morty, air ground neutral attack. Fixed an issue where firing a grenade lock on projectile would trigger Morty's snake cooldown. All right. So Morty has some bugs. Ground side attack. Fixed an issue where Morty could not jump or dodge during his side attack combo. Morty look like he's going to be more viable. Nice. Rain dog. Ground side attack. Jump branch window delayed six frames. He still had his loops. That's why they, <laughs> they did that. Rain dog still had the loops. Shaggy. We reverted Shaggy air neutral attack so now it can be canceled early on hit but it did not get into this patch this change will be coming in a patch in the very near future okay so shaggy shit is not fixed yet ground side attack two jump branch window delayed 11 frames okay air ground neutral special fixed an issue where shaggy would float away while charging rage under certain conditions wow i didn't even know that was a thing superman ground side attack remove the ability to jump or dodge during the rapid jab i like that we needed that <clears throat> let's go they're recognizing what we need whoa 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 taz air down attack hitbox size increase he didn't need that his down attack was ass but now incurs a repeat move lockout to prevent trapping enemies okay i'm cool with that joker we are aware of the joker's strength we are assessing ways to bring him more in line with the current cast of fighters. These balance changes will be introduced in an upcoming patch. What? They leave a joker to still be broken? At least he's acknowledged. They acknowledge it. At least they did that. Airside special. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. On oh, whiff, branch window delayed five frames. They were spamming the hell out of this. You couldn't even attack them. Let's go. At least they did that. That move was so oppressive. Okay, Tom and Jerry. Ground side attack two. Hit stun reduced slightly. Ground side attack three. Hit stun reduced slightly. Okay, these are for the people who know how to do the Tom and Jerry loop. This is why they did that to reduce that loop. I, I'm cool with that. Oh, Velma! I didn't Velma, even play Velma! 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 Velma. 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 <laughs> 
go. We are aware of some some early field issues with Velma following the initial launch. These are the start of some some of some planned adjustments we have for her, and we will have more to share in the coming weeks. All right, ground side attack more reliably combos from attack two to three. All right, cool. Air ground neutral attack hitbox now better covers Velma arm and head. Nice. Removed automatic targeting on ally. Nice. We Thank needed you. that. Thank you. Yep. Air up attack. Increase movement control. Air down attack. Increase movement control. Air ground down. Air ground and down special. Oh, cooldown reduced to 80 seconds from 120 seconds. Cool. Air side special. Increase movement control. All I need from her, they need to give some knockback. She got movement. Yeah. She just needs some knockback. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna play Velma today to see how she how she feels. I don't think she's a character as of yet. Like they, they're acknowledging, you know, some things, but I don't think they're they're there yet. But she got some things now. She seems like she can work. All right, Wonder Woman. Oh my God. She why she, why does Wonder Woman only got one thing? We are aware of Wonder Woman's strength and are assessing ways to bring her more in line with the current cast of fighters. These balance changes will be introduced in an upcoming patch. Bracer meter now resets when Wonder Woman is wrong out. That's it.